The Sky Mirror, also known as Cicerone Beach, is a unique natural phenomenon where during certain times of the month, the shallow waters create a mirror-like reflection, giving the illusion of walking on the sky. Many visitors love taking photos here because of the surreal experience it offers. Don't miss out on the full experience keep watching until the end. Trust me, it's worth it. Your journey with us isn't complete until you've seen it all. Thanks for sticking around. Grab to get to the sky mirror is pretty straightforward. You can simply open the grab app, set your location, and choose the sky mirror jetty as your destination. Once you arrive, you'll have a specific amount of time to explore and take pictures, as the area is only accessible during low tide. It's recommended to check the tide schedule in advance and plan your trip accordingly. Here's a list of essentials to prepare for a comfortable and enjoyable experience. Pack sunscreen, sunglasses, hats, and clothing that offer sun protection, as you'll be exposed to sunlight during the visit. Carry a waterproof bag to protect your belongings, especially if you plan to bring cameras, phones, or other valuables onto the sandbars. Wear beach appropriate and comfortable clothing. Swimsuits or light, breathable and bright color clothes are recommended. Bring water shoes or sandals that can get wet, as you might walk on wet sand or in shallow water. Don't forget your camera or smartphone for capturing stunning photos. Ensure they're fully charged and have enough storage space. Bring bottled water and light snacks to stay hydrated. Boarding the boat at the waiting bay is an exciting moment, marking the beginning of your journey to the sky mirror. Once everyone is settled on the boat, the boat operators or guides typically conduct a safety briefing. During this briefing, they will go over essential safety information, such as the location of life jackets, emergency procedures, and guidelines for behavior while on the boat and at the sky mirror site. They might also provide information about the duration of the trip, the schedule for the visit, and any specific rules or regulations to follow at the destination. After the safety briefing, it's time to set off. The boat ride to the sky mirror can be part of the adventure, offering scenic views of the surrounding area and sometimes glimpses of wildlife if you're lucky. As you approach the sky mirror, the anticipation builds. The sight of the shallow waters creating that mirror-like effect and the possibility of capturing stunning photos often excites everyone on board. The boat will anchor at the designated spot, allowing visitors to disembark and explore the area. It's an exhilarating moment when you finally arrive at the sky mirror, and the experience of walking on what seems like a reflective surface is truly unique. Enjoy your time there, take plenty of photos, and soak in the beauty of this natural wonder. The timing of the low tide is crucial for a successful visit to the sky mirror. Typically, the best time to experience this natural wonder is during the new moon and full moon periods when the tides are at their lowest. These periods offer the optimal conditions for the sandbars to emerge, allowing visitors to witness the mirror-like effect. Walking around on the exposed sandbars during low tide is a big part of the experience. The sandbars create an otherworldly landscape, seemingly endless with reflective surfaces that give the illusion of walking on water. As you explore, you'll find that the area is relatively expansive during low tide, allowing you to wander around and enjoy the unique environment. Some visitors opt to walk barefoot, feeling the softness of the sand under their feet while marveling at the reflective surface that mirrors the sky above. At the Sky Mirror in Selangor, tour operators often prepare designated photo spots or photo booths to enhance visitors' experiences. Operators identify prime locations on the sandbars that provide the best lighting and reflective surfaces during low tide. These spots are typically chosen for their excellent photo opportunities. Marking designated areas, 
to guide visitors, operators mark or designate specific spots with markers, ropes, or signs, indicating where photo taking is encouraged or where the best reflections can be found. Arrangement of props and set dressing, operators place props and set up thematic elements to enhance the visual appeal of the designated photo spots. This might include colorful umbrellas, beach chairs, creative signage, or thematic decorations that complement the natural beauty of the surroundings. Installation of reflective surfaces, in some instances, operators might strategically place mirrors or reflective surfaces to accentuate the mirror effect, creating captivating photo opportunities for visitors. Guidance and assistance, staff members or guides are stationed nearby to provide assistance and guidance. They offer tips on angles, poses, and creative ideas for photos, helping visitors make the most of the unique environment. At the Sky Mirror in Selangor, operators often assist visitors with taking photos at designated photo spots or photo booths. Operators or guides may suggest various poses and creative ideas for photos while you wait in line. They might recommend poses that work well with the surroundings or provide ideas for group shots or individual poses. Some tour operators or nearby establishments might offer packaged snacks or refreshments as part of their tour packages. These could include bottled drinks, packaged snacks, or light refreshments to keep visitors hydrated and energized during their visit. After the allocated time for exploring and taking photos at the sky mirror, guides, or boat operators will signal that it's time to gather and return to the boats. Visitors board the boats, and the operators ensure everyone is accounted for before departing. Near the jetty or departure point for the sky mirror tours, you can find several seafood restaurants or eateries offering a variety of seafood dishes. These establishments cater to tourists and locals, providing an opportunity to enjoy a seafood lunch before or after your Sky Mirror visit. Near the Sky Mirror in Selangor, Malaysia, you can explore several temples and cultural sites that offer unique experiences. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please consider giving it a thumbs up, sharing it with your friends, and subscribing to our channel. Subscribing will keep you updated on all our new content. We appreciate your support and look forward to having you join us for future videos. See you soon.